This is a video to explain about hooked bowing. The first thing to notice about hooked bowing is that in the music, you will see a curved line and dots, staccato dots underneath the notes. So the curved line is somewhat like a slur where your bow keeps moving in the same direction for more than one note. But the dots tell you that you're going to stop the bow and separate the notes. So if I was to play this first pattern here, you would see I would take two down bows in a row and then two up bows in a row. But you can hear that there's a stop in between each note. Like that. Um, hooked bowing can also connect notes that are of different pitches. Like here, we have three notes moving up. That might sound like this. And you could see all my bows went down. I'll try it again for you. There we go. And um, they could go back down too. Um, and you can hear that there's a distinct stop in between each note. It's not like a slur or legato playing. It's hooked and it has that staccato element to it. All right, the last thing to note is that Hooked bows can also connect notes of different lengths. And when you do that, you're gonna to have to make sure that you're counting to two for the half note, and then we have a single um, quarter note at the end. So that might sound like this. One, two, three. And you could hear that there was a space in between the two notes. Like that. So we have more than one note that is in the same bow, but the bow stops in between each of those notes. And that's hooked bowing.